What's up, YouTube? Paul Hine here, and we're back at it. Battling the world bosses. We're going to take down this Kraken, and I got a feeling I'm going to strike the last blow. So without further ado, let me shrink my cam, and we'll jump into the game. Whoa. I think that's too small. That's good, right? Let's blow this up to full screen. Over here to the totem pole. Bam. Bruce Bruce is dead. The sea serpent. Yeah, we're definitely going after the Kraken next. Some people are actually going after the sea serpent, you can tell from my last video. I think this is over 700,000 uh, XP life left, so now we're below 700,000, which is good. I like it. Teamwork, you know, maybe we'll defeat the Kraken a little bit quicker, and then we can try to get all three bosses. Pirate Nation don't think we could do it as a community, but I think, I think we got a chance. So this is fire. We're definitely going to want to water. I, I heard that water goes good against fire. <laughs> I did uh, water and speed last time. She did a pretty good job. I think we just got like six to seven hundred damage. But let's do water and accuracy. I definitely want to try to get a lot of hits in. The power strike is what gives a lot of damage. So I'm gonna to try to try to hit a lot of power strikes. <clears throat> it's pretty cool how it shows all the stats of the pirates. Right there, you can pick one right before battle. I'm gonna start off hot and heavy. Hit him with the power strike. Come on. That's what I'm talking about. So you can see this is definitely a little lag when I'm playing. It only does this while I'm streaming. I promise this game is flawless when I'm not streaming. Makes me want to go out and get a nice computer, like a, a better new computer. <clears throat> so it seems like the damage that the Kraken inflicts almost goes based off of the damage that I inflict on the Kraken. So that was, uh, I think I used Dirty Tactics there, and I inflicted less damage, but I also received less damage than when I did the Power Strike. So the, um, I'm pretty sure the Dirty Tactic was 150. Let's see if I hit. This is going to be 180. So now if I get hit, it's probably going to be 30 damage. There it is. Figured it out. So the lighter hit that you give on them, this is 105. So if I do get hit, I expect like a 25 damage. I think maybe two misses, nice. That's good, that's good. Ooh, it's not the shot I wanted to miss, because this could, this could hurt. Yeah, 32 and a half damage, wow. It's actually more damage than before. So I don't have it all figured out. <laughs> Can't wait till we can start driving the boat around ourselves. Start doing some PvP, battle people in the open water. It's gonna be a lot of fun. We're getting beat up. We are definitely getting beat up. I need those 180s. I need those power hits. Come on, miss, miss, miss. That's it. I'm done. Ah, oh, go ahead, hit me again while I'm down. Kick me while I'm down. Not bad. Not bad at all. Take a little picture of this for Twitter. Shout out Pirate Nation. Shout out to Pirate Nation. And shout out to all the diehard fans that play this game. I know you know who you are. Pirate Nation really does have such a great community. Huge hit on the Kraken at Pirate Nation. Over 1k damage. I'll put the fire emoji. Boom. The 
return it to Island for repairs. Alright, let me see if I can get this Easter egg. I know I try to show you guys almost every single stream, but I want to get to this island. I want to get to this island. I want to show you guys what's going on here. My biggest struggle is that uh, the game's a little bit laggy when I'm streaming, so that's like what's been stopping me. When I'm not streaming, I, I'll get this every day. So he seems to be stuck right at the edge of the water. It's so weird. Maybe somebody watching this could. All right, look at that. There he goes. I'm gonna get on the lower part over here. Looks like my click's not registering on that part of the screen. There he is. So boom, we got him right here to the very edge of this drop off. We're just gonna wait for the boat to come by. When the boat starts to come by, jump on the boat. Once we're on the boat, we stay on it until we get to the island. Boom, jump on the island. Sounds easy, right? <laughs> let's let's see. If you've been playing Pirate Nation, I'm sure you've done this a bunch of times. For those who haven't watched Pirate Nation or haven't played with Pirate Nation. Check it out. This is a little Easter egg. Boat comes by. Quick, get on the boat. Got to stay on the boat. Stay on the boat. Oh, I made it. You seen that was a little scary. That was a little hairy. Now that I'm on the island, I can do stuff like... Like this. This whole voxel design is really cool. I like it. The little pirates, perfect. I couldn't imagine this guy running around the island. You know, this box of pirates just fits. It's like playing with Legos. So the pirates have lots of different commands. We don't get to control the commands, but we can click on the pirate just to see what else he can do. Trying to get him to face us, but he don't want to look at us today. He's getting a little shy. But that's it. I just wanted to show you one of the little Easter eggs. I know there's a few more, like jumping on some of the different buildings. Pretty sure there's a way to jump on this little totem pole right here, and that's pretty cool. This little tiki tiki guy that's on fire, and you could also jump up on this totem pole as well. You come up on this land, you jump down, and somehow you jump up on the tree. <laughs> crazy stuff but again huge shout out to pirate nation love the game love what you guys are doing can't wait to see this fully complete in its, its final form you know huge can't wait all right guys tune in next time if you have any questions or comments you know where to drop them and please hit the like button 